brought greetings to share with us tonight. Please welcome the co-chairs, our co-chairs for this 25th Golden Daffodil Ball, Glenn Chen, Chan Wai Choi, Sizan, and Selwyn Lo, Lo, Siu Fong, Sizan. As we come up to the stage, you will recognize Selwyn was the singer of our own candidate. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, distinguished guests, dignitaries, sponsors, and friends of the media. On behalf of the organizing committee and the board of directors of the Golden Daffodil Ball and the Golden Daffodil Endowment Fund, welcome to the 25th Annual Golden Daffodil Charity Ball, our silver anniversary. A quarter century ago, a group of Chinese volunteers in GDA Saw the, saw the need of increasing cancer awareness in the community, as well as the necessity to support cancer research initiatives. The Golden Daffodil Charity Ball was formed with the main purpose of raising funds for support of the work of the Canadian Cancer Society. In short, we call them CTS. And here we are, a quarter century later. Through so much hard work, determination, and stamina from the organizing committee, volunteers and support, supporters like yourself, we're still here. For the past 24 years, we helped raise over three and a half million dollars. Other than the $78,000 that was earmarked for a, for a vehicle for the Wheels of Hope program, the rest of the money was donated to CCS to be used for research on early diagnostic, prevention, and treatment of all forms of cancer. Even though we are only a small part of the whole success story, but I'm glad to report that the chances of an individual being diagnosed with cancer in a lifetime has dropped from 50% years ago, now down to 40%. That's two in five. It is, it is an improvement, but we should be, it is an improvement that we should all should be proud of but it is still a very high percentage. I'm glad we are a small part of this success. With our continuous and collective efforts in raising funds for more cancer research, this percentage will further drop to 30, then 20, and total eradication. It might take a few more years, but we are on the right track. However, there's a one disturbing news that came out recently. The age of cancer patient is getting younger. That is a real concern. I was told that cancer cells are usually more aggressive in younger people, therefore more pain and more suffering. As a result, collectively, we must help to reverse this trend. I'm extremely happy to see so many of you here tonight. It is a confirmation for me that after 25 years, this continues to be a worthwhile event to participate and support. Tonight we have prepared quite a bit of entertainment for you. Hopefully you will enjoy. While you're enjoying the entertainment, please keep in mind this is a fundraising event. We would like to raise some more funds for the cancer for, for cancer research. Therefore, please do participate in our silent auction out there, and maybe if you like, fill out the donation forms available at each table. Thank you very much.